Good afternoon, good morning, good evening, good 3 a.m. If you're watching at 3 a.m., let me know in the comments. Today, we're going to be playing another game from the Steam Next Fest collection. We're going to be playing Magic Craft. Seems like a uh, fun little roguelike battler. We're going to start a new uh, save file. We're going to start. <gasps> Look, it's us. It's us. Right, right there. That's us. Main tank, keep attracting the boss's attention. Mage, you're the only one left. Don't give up. Ugh, you're distracting me with your talking. Oh my. No way. You beat it. Duh, who do you think? Duh, who do you think you're talking to? That's amazing. Will you go to the dungeon later? Of course, but the night is young. Let me go to the toilet first. Oh no. It's a gamer. <laughs> Gonna use the toilet here. Take a piss. I tend to do that quite a bit too. Mages are so strong. This is what I think about when I pee as well. I wish I was a real mage. Although, I wish for teleportation most of the time. Teleportation is, like, the strongest superpower you can get. Especially if, like, there's no other superpowers. Because, like, who needs super strength if there's no one to fight, right? Think about it. Think about it. Where in the world am I? Whoa, what is that, uh... What's that little animation glitch? Oh, I see now. It's because... All right, he f his vision follows the mouse, and then his body follows the... Okay, so it's pretty much like a straight-up Isaac deal. There's a stick here. Hey, he did it! Oh, no, he did it. <laughs> Ah, what happened? I saw something white run over here. After a hundred years, a hero has finally arrived. Ah, why can I hear someone talking to me in my head? <laughs> Little pipsqueak, are you the hero? You look so weak and helpless, and I can't sense any magic power in you. Wait a minute. Who are you? Why are you inside me? <laughs> oh, ooh, okay. Ayo? I'm a magic elf who has been sealed in this magic wand to wait for the chosen hero. You are that hero. I'm the chosen one? So I'm the protagonist? Well, I have a harem. Ugh. Come on, kid. A harem? What's that? <laughs> it's like the boys going back in time versus girls going back in time. Boys going back in time. Where's my harem? Er, uh, it's nothing. Um, forget it. Since I'm the protagonist, I command you to send me home. I've got an insurance. In, I've got. I've got an instance to download and play. Hero, you're in a world invaded by ancient gods. Even time and space have been disrupted, which might be why you've come here. It won't be easy for you to return to your own world, but you may be able to find a way back if you defeat the ancient gods. Okay, so it's sort of like uh, Isekai, find your way home sort of deal. I have nothing to worry about since I'm the protagonist. Let's go. That's fun. It's funny how easily he says that. It would be much funnier if he was a side character in this. Alright, I'm assuming I need to go through that portal right there. Start adventure. Let's do it. Oh, <gasps> Mysterious person. Dot, dot, dot. I can't believe it. That young man pulled out the magic wand. That story is just a legend, Vivian. Oh, Vivian. Hello. But our teacher said... <laughs> I don't know what to do with their voices. Come on. <laughs> I wouldn't believe that nonsense about a hero unless he manages to make it back alive. Well, hopefully we can make it back alive. All right. Shoot with click. Run into the mushroom right away. We get a thingy, levitation potion. You will be levitated until the next door. Hold right trigger to use a potion. So we can levitate now. We have a specific range we can get, it seems. And then we're supposed to just fly over. So this is like tutorial level. We got some very well-designed mushroom enemies, if I do say so myself. Look at him, he's so cute. 
<laughs> we have our first enhancement. Poisonous Crystal. Apply a stack of poison. Up for three seconds. Up to 30 stacks. We hit tab. We drag it down. Okay, so now it's poison. Bigger mushrooms. And they're poisoned. Ocean man, take me by the hand, lead me to the land. This used to be a garden where mages did spiritual training. Now all that's left are these ruins and those crazy monsters. I hope I don't go crazy. Okay, now I just sound like the... <laughs> the crystals the monsters dropped are really useful. You might be able to enhance your pitiful magic power if you collect them. That... Hmm. That sounds a little strange. Well, I don't see those in my, like, inventory. Alright. We got more stuff to fight. We have a health bar and st other stuff down there. Can I just... Oh, I can just shoot through the butterflies. I understand now. Took some damage there. That's okay. Forgot about the butterflies. Oh, this guy lets out a bunch of butterflies. Oh, shit. It's okay. It's our first time playing. Holy shit. Please, don't do this to me. Do these... Those don't explode. Oh, it's a cross. This must be the relic. Uh -huh. Although monsters lurk in every corner of this world, there are also countless treasures left by our ancestors. The shiny object over there is one of them, and it can be a greatly... En and it can greatly enhance your abilities. Give it a try. SSR? Points drop, three points of shield. Deals 35 damage to all enemies when taking damage. Well, I'm great at taking damage. Let's go for another relic. That sounds pretty cool. We've got a uh, slime trail here. It also looks like we have something here that... Uh, I feel like I'm letting him do too much to me. All right, if there are coins in there, I assume I won't take damage, right? Oh, it's just a slowdown, I understand. We'll take our next relic and another coin. Dryadic robe, recover five HP when entering a door. That's pretty cool. 30% chance to summon a soul or we get three points of shield. Let's go with the robe. We'll take some health regen. Especially if we're going to... We don't have any curses. Spell. I want to see what a spell is, so let's do this one. We have our spider enemies. Perfect. Exactly what you need in some sort of Isaac-like game. I'm sure they're going to terrify me and piss me off over and over. I should do an Isaac video at some point. Maybe I'll record one of those while I'm uh, waiting around for streaming to come back. It'll probably be, let's see, today is the 19th, I think, when I'm recording this. So, uh, I should be back streaming by, like, the 21st. Alright, we got a potion. Permanently increased movement speed. Permanent? That's awesome. And now we get new spells. I guess those are in my backpack. Uh, summoning... Ghost fire. I do want to try these out. Do we want to make a poisonous... Okay, Mr. K is not poisonous. Let's just see what we're working with. So these are my orbs. Seems like he takes a lot of... So they do damage and they stay around for a minute. It seems like that's their, like, function. We have two gold. I don't think it's worth it going to a shop yet. 
Let's just try out with these uh, summons. The summons seem to do quite a bit. And if enemies are dumb, they'll run right into him, it seems. Oh, and they bounce. Maybe I'll be able to find a way to up the projectile speed. Alright, we got some money out of that. We're up to 17. Process. Let's go for another relic. I don't know what the process is. Summons. It seems like their speed is kind of variable. We missed. Missed again. I guess direction is also pretty variable. Did I take damage there? Oh, okay, their speed isn't variable. Immune to all damage for 8 seconds. That's pretty great. We got Titan Pauldrons. More size, less recoil. Summon three elves that can intercept spells for you. That seems pretty great. Oh, that's kind of like uh, the purple fly. Oh, I get some knockback from the summoning. Re what? So I get a curse, but I get stuff? Is that what's happening? Slows down time. So our movement speed is down, but we do have these shields, and we did get some money out of it and some health. Let's get another spell. Oh, that took a lot of damage. Oh, he shoots at me. Okay, so those flies come back slowly, and they block shots. That's good to know. That's not good to know. Alright, the red runs shoot at me. Man, these summons are not doing much. I might switch off of them. We'll finish him off. We get some health back. We get more spells. And we get a boss. Wow, I'm definitely going to get an SSR this time. Why do you keep talking about SSR? What is it exactly? It's those particularly rare cards in mobile games. Do you play any mobile games? Pillar of Light. Another summon. And then we get an Overload Scatter. It's an enhancement. Okay, so it seems like an Overload Scatter might. So where does this go? So what are they tougher now? What if I What if I get rid of Mr. K? <clears throat> oh, those are that's what these are. So what's Mr. K? Oh, he costs 80 mana. I can't even use him yet. What do I have him? Those are 3 mana. That's Enhancements. What are we at right now? 90 degree scatter, which is kind of a lot. What if we just do this? Now we got two of them. That's a little rough. I think I might stick with this, but I think I'll do two of them. Yeah, I like that better, I think. They are pretty short, but I also don't have very good aim, so I can just shoot out more of them now. Oh, it's, uh, whatever you are. Holy shit. Come into my eyes. Oh, these flies are really good, it seems. Oh, it's, a. Uh... Still destroyed, wow. I got a really good item. 
Oh, and then I took a bunch of damage. Fly deals with those. Two flies have to deal with that. Good to know. Two flies. Perfect. Alright, so I sort of cheesed this guy a little bit, huh? That was tough. We got... Blood. We got... Stagnant space-time. So it has... Charges two points per meteor while moving. Floating ghost fire projectile. So we got another projectile for floating ghost. We got better regen, fire intervals a little higher. Let's do it. This wand seems to have some special slots. What is this post slot used for? Generally speaking, it's not much different from common slots, and you can also equip spells in them. Whenever a spell is in a slot in the front triggers the charging conditions, the post slot will be charged. All spells in the post slot will be fired when the slot is fully charged. How much energy will the post slot use then? That depends on the total MP cost of your spells in the post slots. Um, let's figure this out. You know, I'm beginning to think that I really, really enjoy poison builds. Look, uh, what, uh, wonder where that's from. Wonder where that is. Oh well. If you're enjoying yourself, make sure to like the video. And if you're enjoying the content, consider subscribing. I'm trying to release a lot more videos, especially during Next Fest with all these demos. I'll talk to you later. Enjoy the rest of the video. Why am I shooting? Oh. Is it just firing because I have a lot of energy or something? Charges 15 points per second while standing still. Wait, that's actually really good. What does he do? That's really cool. So I can just stand still. That seems pretty strong. Let's try it out. Uh, we'll go for more spells. I just seem like kind of a staller character, huh? Alright, I summon a new one. Wow, they do a lot of butterflies, huh? We have a spider again. We gotta find a way to get up there, huh? Come on, spider, you can do it. Oh no, he didn't do it. Oh, we might have to take some damage here. Somehow we didn't take any? Oh, now we did. So we get our spider when we stand still, which is pretty cool. Took some damage there. That's my bad. Accelerator. Alright, let's look at these. Summons, plus 40 attack speed and movement speed, but lose 4 HP per second. The parasites are pretty cool. Does that work if he's in the slot over there? No, it doesn't. Oh, they're a lot faster now. That's actually really good. Let's go for more spells. This summon seems pretty strong. I fell. My bad. I'm almost considering getting rid of the splitting. With how high my projectile speed is now, I think I'm okay with, like, dropping. Let's look at this. 
Overload scatter. So less, and then more simultaneously shooting, plus five. That's not as bad. And I can fire pretty much simultaneously. That's not awful. We get another overload scatter and another poison crystal. We get more coins this round. Oh shit. Alright, so they... Do some rude stuff to me, it seems. Get back here. Get back here, you little rascal. Oh, now you've done it, Bozo. Oh, maybe I've done it, Bozo. Oh, yep, okay, I took some damage there. Take some money. We get another relic here. That's pretty cool. I think I'm just better off doing that. Get some health back, I think. Uh-oh. Oh, that's so many sp butterflies. They're going after my summon? You know what? I'll just take a little bit of damage there. I probably could have shot more of those, but whatever. We are taking a decent amount of damage. This game seems really fun. More, L more HP coming back. Soul Bone Box. Let's do more HP coming back. We're kind of weak. Oh, <laughs> no, I do not like those at all. Do we have any keys? We do not have any keys. More spiders? Or snakes, or whatever the hell you are. Oh, even worse ones. Oh, even more. Did my spider just fall? Well, I'm not really that worried about it. I knocked him off. So now there's just that guy left. Sick! Maybe there's a chance to get some... something over here. Alright, so we got a coin out of it. We have to break the other tree, I guess. No, it looks like we can't really get through there. Another magic missile or a fuse. Cast the first missile summon spell on the right when the spell ends. What does that mean? Oh, that's actually... That seems really strong. Don't have a key. Let's get some more spell. I don't really know what I want to do here. We have pretty good range now. This view seems really good, though. I can just shoot stuff really far and then deal with them. Looks like the snakes don't aggro too far away, or too much. Sorry, it seems like I have some distance before I have to deal with the aggro. Revolution, spell duration, revolution effect, the spell will revolve around the caster. Let's just take another fuse. 
Ooh, we have a shop coming up. That's great. Let's go. What do we got here? Large shield. Restore HP. We don't need two keys. We should probably get those. Conflux source. Uh, I don't know about that. Frost crystal. Another Mr. K? I'm okay with that. I think I'll also take... Nah, that seems like enough. Let's go for more spells. I kind of want to see what else there is. I mean, this is a demo. I'm not too worried about winning right away. Oh, I am destroying that spider, dude. I even got some, like, ricochet stuff going. Mr. K seems very helpful. That's a big mushroom, though. Uh, Mr. K, help me! There he is. There's my guy. Yeah, I seem to have things pretty easy thanks to all these, uh... Duration or overload. Let's take more overload. Maybe I can combine stuff. Uh, we have another boss, it seems. Chaotic Wreckage. Oh, this is like the boss boss. Oh, no. I think my projectile might actually be... I know what I need. You. And you. There we go. Oh, shit. Oh, come on, Mr. K. Save me! Mr. K, please... Shit. I can do this. I have a really good build. Please. Mr. K. Mr. K. I'm 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 nowhere near him, am I? Shit. Okay, I took too much damage there. Mr. K, I'm close to him. Oh, I killed it! Whew! Oh, and there's Mr. K. Hey, buddy. Wow. All right, we got a sacrificial dagger. Reduces the indiscriminate damage dealt by this wand to you to 1%. Endless book. Gets a scatter. Gets a really low fire interval. Um, I don't want either. I guess I'll open it, but I don't think I'm going to take it. I'm going to skip back to Mr. K. So these are like a combination. I kind of like my build so far. Alright, let's go to the next chapter. <coughs> Excuse me. Fortress of Eternity. Alright, I get another relic off of this. <laughs> Congratulations on making it through the forest. You're surprisingly talented. I hope you'll also be able to feel this relaxed here. Where are we? It looks like someone lives here. <laughs> this was once a fortress, and it was the human's last line of defense against the ancient gods. It has stood for decades since the monster invasion started and is known as the Fortress of Eternity. As supplies dwindled, the monsters eventually captured the fortress and still occupy it today. What a waste of space. They don't even use pillows. Come on, guy. What are you thinking? Okay. 
congratulations on completing the quest. Thanks for participating in the test. If you like the game, please add it to your wish list on Steam. That's our greatest source. I see. That's our greatest source of... Well, it doesn't seem like there's anything else. No, we lost! Alright, let's see what the dying is like in this game. This one might be a little too easy. What were their voices? Haha, -ha, it looks like our hero is already dead. But why did he die here? I don't know. Is that going to be my voice for her? He's still breathing. I guess so. Weird. I can't see any wounds on his body. He was probably scared to death. Ah! <laughs> Who are you two? Don't tell me you were thinking of taking advantage of me while I was sleeping. Almost forgot the voice. Take advantage of you? Are you out of your mind? Hero, it's great that you're okay. Hero, it's great that you're okay. Oh, we have people now. Hero, if you ever need any help to defeat the ancient gods, just let me know and I'll help you. Oh, that's so nice of you, but I can't possibly ask you to do that. This is my duty. My teacher asked us to help the one who pulls out the magic wand. If you find any crystals during your adventures, I can help you become stronger. Oh, crystals. Excellent. These crystals are exactly what I was talking about. Okay, so we have wand limit. I don't know what that means. We have backpack limit. We have initial coins. And we have max health. Hmm. We only have three god bloods, so we can't level it up that much. Let's up our backpack limit. Oh, we can have multiple wands now. I understand now. Uh, initial coins is pretty cool. We'll do some max HP, and we'll do some initial coins. There we go. So now we start with 12 coins. Now let's see what this other one wants. Do you know? It was once prophesied that the person who pulls out the magic wand from here is the hero who will save the world. Oh, I just found out. <laughs> I wonder if the prophecy will still come true if I make the person who pulled out the magic wand disappear. Oh, she's evil. Um, it's nice to meet you, too. So I guess she doesn't do anything. That was fun. What does this mean? Oh. Hey, let's do all that again. There we go. All right, I think that's a pretty good stopping point. That was a lot of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought of the game, what you thought of the gameplay, what you thought of my awful voices. Please definitely tell me about that. Uh, either way, I'll see you next video. Have a good day.